Something for recovery. Ultra marathon runner and former addict Henry Ward is hoping to help people seeking sobriety get back on their feet. ABC 15's Cameron Pullum is sharing his story and how he's raising money to help pay for people's treatment in a unique way. I'd rather be outdoors. Henry Ward is outrunning his demons. Nine years ago, I couldn't run from here to, to Walgreens without being completely winded and gassed. He's been pulling away day by day since 2008, refusing to look back. Yeah, I mean, there's 25 million Americans that are you know, actively suffering from addiction. Now more than a decade into sobriety, Ward draws his inspiration from his wife, who refused to leave the future of his nine-year-old son, and it's the running that keeps him on track. And I found there's a lot of people just like me, people su suffering from addiction, anxiety, other mental health, health issues. Uh, and I, and I had a whole new group of friends, this running community. Prior to finding his new obsession, the dark days nearly killed him, drinking to excess, hurting his friends and family. I cheated death many times. I used to drink and drive all the time. You know, despite a few head-on collisions, DUIs, it wasn't enough to for me to stop. He finally did seek out treatment, something he calls the best decision of his life. That's when his journey really hit its stride and running his vehicle to change the world for the better. I ran a stage race in Argentina. I ran in Mexico and all over the United States. Through his foundation running without the devil, he's raised more than $14,000. I'm accepting donations to help people afford treatment. Basically, people in the Maricopa County, we have uh, what's we're going to be launching a transformation fund. On Wednesday, inside Chandler MMA, Ward will step on this treadmill and stay on it for 24 straight hours. Every dollar raised by the run helps pay to transform a life. We're going to be documenting, filming, um, a couple selected people that, that apply that are suffering from addiction and we're going to get them into a running program and train them for an ultra marathon. He says it'll be difficult, but anything worth having always is reflecting on his own experience now in hopes of changing the path of others. To quit does not exist. I'm Cameron Polam, ABC 15, Arizona. Well, if you'd like to donate to this effort, we've put those details on ABC15.com. And if you or someone you know is battling addiction, it's important to remember you're not alone. Right now on your screen, a list of resources for addiction treatment, prevention, and recovery, both here in Arizona and available nationally. If you or someone you know needs help, please reach out.